Hello everyone, this is MR69970 and Epic Airsoft Team, and today I'm going to be trying to make a sale because I'm in need of some money so that I can get the new Silent Death Airsoft Gun. Um, the reason I'm trying to make money is, yeah, I just want to get the Silent Death. So, I'm going to be selling this. It's the MP5A5 Navy. It's a full metal uh, submachine gun. It's in very good condition except for like that. Like the, it fires perfectly. So I'm gonna go with all the add-ons that you get with this gun, and there's plenty of them. Like a barrel extension and kind of a mock suppressor, but not really. So to put that on a gun, you just line up these little holes and slide it on. Then you put the clip on, and there you go. And I guess if you really wanted to, you could just paint it. So on to the next thing, we have the battery. Um, this battery is capable with a lot of other guns. Um, try and get it so that it's not all light. Yep, it's 1100 volts, I think. And, yep. And now here's the big thing. Oh yeah, this gun, it just, see, it just clips in right there. Um, the big part about this gun is like another really good add-on is not one, not two, but three clips. Yep. Three high cap mags. They're all hold 250 to 300 uh, 250 to 300 BBs. And since uh, um, since I'm nice, I filled up which one? This one. I filled it up just about all the way. Not really though. Um. So a quick review of this gun. Uh, you can if you watch the MR69970 channel, um, I mean the Epic Airsoft channel, there is a review of this, and my intense Spaz 12, but I'm never going to sell that because that's just too amazing. So I'm going to go front to back for once on this gun. So you start, of course, with the mock suppressor barrel extension, and then just to take it off, you slide it this way, and you push this button the other way. It just slips off. So if you're like one of those people who likes to paint things, you could paint the tip of this gun, put it on, and bam, it looks like a real gun. Now, here's the front sight, and I zip tied it so that it does not come off. Because, like, when this part, when this thing isn't on, this thing can slide off relatively easily, so I zip tied it so that it can't. Next, this gun has three rails. One, two, and then one on the other side. This one is where you put the battery, and it has a grip, but I'm sorry, I do not have the grip, because it was cheap and it broke. So the rails can be used for flashlights or whatever you want. Flashlights, lasers, grips, whatever. Um, we have the slapper thing, whatever the hell it's called. And I'm trying to do this with one hand. It's real, really hard. What the hell? It's like stuck. Hold on one sec. I'm just going to put down the camera. Alright, so somehow when I left my gun at my friend's house, it got like sticky with something and now it just kind of sticks. So I just close that. Uh, it has very good hop up. You just adjust it to wherever you want. Um, it has a scope clip. You just clip in the sight, like the scope hold, and then you slide in the scope and it works like that. We got a sling mount right here. And right here we have the clip release, and then on the other side of the gun, we have another clip release. Um, we have these selector switches, and it's safety, when it's on safety, as always. Can't really pull the trigger all the way. Uh, semi. And full automatic. Um, this gun does have an adjustable stock, a very good one at that. Um, it goes anywhere from right here 
to. Sorry, hold on, wait one sec. I'm not sure if you can see it, but. Oh, crap. Yep, it extends all the way up to there. So that's pretty nice. Now I'm gonna dry fire because I'm in my bedroom and I don't want anything to fly around. So I want to give you a quick little shooting test. So just, I'm sorry, this is really hard to do with one hand. For all of you airsoft reviewers out there, I know how you feel now. But how damn hard it is to. Perfect. Okay, now keep in mind this battery is not really charged that much. But with the clips they're gear wound just saying. And I'm trying to think of oh yeah, this gun also comes with a charger, it's just not shown in here. It's, it's just a normal charger, not a smart charger or anything. So here's the firing. Here's it on semi. And then here, hold on, wait one sec. Sorry if you can hear those people outside. Alright, so I'm just gonna wait. There's people outside. Alright, now, screw it, full automatic. Yep. So I hope you enjoy watching this gun and this video of the gun and um message me for a price. I'd say my base price is about a hundred and eighty dollars just because three mags, battery full metal, three ninety FPS and this gun's just really good, so message me if you want this gun. But also I have, I'm a big video game player, and I have, the course I went down. and I have a lot of video games, but I don't really play video games that much anymore, so if you see any of these video games that you like, I got Madden 10, UFC 2010, Left 4 Dead, Modern Warfare 2, Skate 2, MLB 2K11, NBA 2K10, um, I don't have World of War, Forza Motorsport 3, UFC 2009 Undisputed, um, Grand Theft Auto 4, and Guitar Hero 3. So, if you want any of these things, just message me and I'll get back to you with a price, and please subscribe.